I'm Channing Arndt. I'm Director of the Environment and Production Technology Division at the International Food Policy Research Institute, and I'm one of the workstream leaders in SA Tide. I cover the climate and energy workstream. We'll be looking at uh, uh, issues uh, in this climate, energy, often water and food nexus. These are exciting times in energy for, for South Africa. When I started working in energy about 10 years ago in South Africa, it was coal-fired power generation as far as the eye could see. Um, there's been a sea change in uh, generation technologies internationally, and, and South Africa actually has very, very good uh, renewable resources. So we're looking at, over the next 30, 35 years, a roll-in of, of renewable energy sources that would generate uh, uh, lower cost electricity, uh, generate more manufacturing, more jobs, greater GDP, and all of this coming in with more with greater environmental benefits. If the rest of the world goes along with South Africa and is using more and more renewable energy, uh, basically mitigating uh, fewer emissions, then you're going to get less climate change.